What's up? Hey guys! We're on another adventure, another fall adventure. Yes, our favorite time of year, and we are on the road again. I know, this is one that we've been wanting to do for a while now. So we're in New England exploring all the fall colors and all the beautiful towns. Yes. And we've got two weeks up here where we're going to be exploring all the states and everything that you can see. Which is our dream trip. We have been dying to do this for so long, so we're super excited to bring you guys along. All the trees have already started changing a lot up here. We're currently in South Deerfield, Massachusetts at the Yankee Candle flagship store. So this is Yankee Candle is Village. So cute. And it's so cute. <laughs> it's so awesome. It's just right off the highway. So it's an easy stop on your way up to Vermont. And that's actually where we're headed. Yeah. So our first stop is going to be our actual destination for this one is going to be Woodstock, Vermont. Yeah. But yeah. We flew into New York and then we're road tripping all the way up. Yep. So. Yep. So we've got a lot of stops along the way and we'll show you guys what we get into. So excited. <laughs> So the Yankee Candle store is a must stop. Absolutely, it is so, so cool. Also way bigger than I expected. Way bigger, oh my gosh. It took us like 30, 45 it's, minutes to walk through. Yeah, it's like a mall for Yankee Candle. They have a Halloween section, a Christmas section, uh, toys, decor, candy, you can build your, your own. Make your own candle. Make your own ca <laughs> candle, yeah, it's, uh, it's pretty wild. Cool. Cafeteria, but yeah, it is so beautiful and so cool. We ended yes. up getting, oh. A, um, a fall scent yes. for the car. We a thought car we scent, yeah. had to do it. Yes, to have the scent in the car while we're driving around. It's an um, apple pumpkin scent. Yeah. So they say the scents are basically connected to your experiences. So you can remember your experience when you smell the scent. Yeah. So we thought it'd be a cool thing to have on this trip. Heck yeah, I know. I'm excited to smell it. <laughs> <laughs> but we're actually about to hit the road so we're going to be entering new hampshire i think next so i think we might stop in this cute little town they have a covered bridge we're going to swing by and see what it looks like yeah i'm excited see you guys there so we just stopped at the vermont visitor center and these leaves are crazy there's literally so many fallen leaves and these trees are just on fire. It is so beautiful. We're already seeing so many beautiful fall colors. And honestly, there's still a lot of trees with a lot of foliage left, so we're really, really excited. So we have a few hours left before we get to our spot up near Woodstock, Vermont. Um, we're gonna stop in Brattleboro, which is actually where we are now, but we're gonna go to the town and check it out and uh, check out this covered bridge that they have there. Easy breathing in your atmosphere. Oh, All right, so we're in Brattleboro, Vermont. Such a cute town. Such a cute town. Love this place. Already. Love it. Yes, yeah, such cool vibes. We're loving all the vibes it's really really cool and it's right on the river the connecticut river we actually drove across the connecticut river uh, on these really cool bridges and we didn't realize this but we actually entered into new hampshire so <laughs> we've been to a lot of states today already yeah, it's pretty cool <laughs> pretty crazy as we were driving through the downtown we noticed that they have a lot of really cool thrift shops and stores and stuff so we're gonna hop in a few and check them out and we'll show you guys what it looks like Without trying Now I'm way up here Oh, how could I? How? 
so we made it to the covered bridge. It's so beautiful. Guys, this is sick. It's so awesome. I also love that there's really no way that cars can actually go through it currently. So yes. you can you actually go over and explore it. And just, yeah, get to yeah. enjoy it. It's pretty chill. But yeah, look at the way that the water streams below and that beautiful tree right there. It is seriously just so perfect. So pretty. So we're gonna head over there and get some shots. Get some shots. We'll show you what we get. Guys, the creamery covered <laughs> I bridge. Like, I don't know what you're saying. <laughs> creamery covered bridge is so cool. It is super cool, and right now the sun is like kind of starting to set. Can't and really so see it on this, but there's spider webs going all across the bridge here, and the light is shining through them, and it's just like the coolest thing to see. Yes, it I is so it. cool. I love it too. Kind of spooky, kind of cool, very pretty. And this is one that was like kind of recommended on things that I had seen, but like there's some more that we're gonna see on this trip that are supposedly like just as breathtaking, if not more. Yeah, so I'm sure. so excited. These covered bridges yeah. are just sick. So this is one that's not as like talked about and I yeah. think it's a must see. Yeah, it's really I mean, cool. it was built in 1879. It's pretty crazy. Oh my gosh, that's nuts. <laughs> Some uh, horse and buggies went across that bridge. <laughs> yeah, it pretty it's cool crazy. Yeah, kind of gives me the uh, uh, Sleepy Hollow vibes. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I think we're gonna keep heading north, and uh, we'll show you what we get into. So we made it to our stay. We made it and we love it. <laughs> Guys, the the views on the way here oh, man. were absolutely crazy, weren't they? Yes, it, they had us very excited for tomorrow, yes. to say the least. Like, I, I know you guys won't be able to tell, but like behind us, there's just so many bright yellow and orange leaves. Yes. We're just it's so dream. It's a yes. fall dream. So we so this day is actually in Hartford, Vermont, which is about 10, 12 minutes or so from uh, downtown Woodstock, Vermont, which is a very sought after place that we're obviously going to explore tomorrow. Um, but and it's about an hour from Stowe, Vermont. We're going to go inside, freshen up a little bit and then go find some food because we're hungry. Yes, we're pretty hungry. <laughs> we'll, uh, we'll show you what we get and into. And cold. And cold. Cold <laughs> and hungry. <laughs> Bad combo. <laughs> All right, so we made it back to our Airbnb after dinner tonight. Dinner was so good. The vibes were crazy. There were uh, there was this band playing and these uh, women got up and started dancing and Megan and I were like, what time did this place close? And the guy was like, uh, we close in like 10 minutes. <laughs> it was so funny, but it was funny because literally when it was time to close, everyone was out of there but yeah our food was amazing megan got a pork mac and cheese bowl and i got i think it was called like doug's hot burger or something like that so i had like this cajun seasoning on the burger with jalapenos and some pepper jack cheese so it was actually really really good highly recommend that place was called public house right meg public house yes yeah yeah so yeah, it was really cool. And then we drove to downtown Woodstock to get some goods for tomorrow. And we're so excited. The downtown looks amazing. So we can't wait to check it out. But yeah, we're winding down. We're gonna hop in bed because we got an early start tomorrow. We'll see you guys tomorrow. Good night. So day two here in Vermont and we're about to head towards Woodstock but we just woke up and uh, got out and look at these beautiful chickens. So the owner of this Airbnb had these chickens on property and they are beautiful. It was so funny as we were like getting ready to leave 
they were literally standing at our door making the most noise. They're like, it's time to get up, it's time to go. It's so funny. But yeah, look at that really big one over there. Look at his feet, dude. His feet are crazy. You're getting real close to him. Oh me. my gosh, look at him. He's, he's the Bosch chicken. That's nuts. But yeah, look at this beautiful property though. All of the fall colors are just going off. We're so excited. We can't wait to get out and explore today. So we're gonna take you guys along. We're gonna head up to Stowe and look around for a little bit and then we're gonna head back to Woodstock and finish our day exploring Woodstock and all the beautiful things that it offers. We'll show you guys what we get into. Stopped off in Peach Gorge, and oh my gosh, we just drove over the bridge, and it's insane. It's so beautiful, right along the highway, so it's pretty loud. But uh, yeah, we're gonna take some photos here and show you guys what it looks like. It's like an iconic spot. You definitely have to check it out if you're in Woodstock. Come with me. Oh, you like the sun coming up. You make my world come. The Kichi Gorge is sick. It's beautiful. It is so beautiful. So this is actually Kichi State Park where we're parked currently. And it's got all the fall colors, yeah. all the fall vibes. It's really, really nice. Highly recommend checking it out. Yeah, definitely. So we're at Monvert Cafe in so downtown Woodstock. Yes. Meg, what'd you get? I got the classic, um, and it's just a sandwich with cheese, bacon, and eggs. It looks so good. And I got, what did I get? I don't know. It's like a California <laughs> breakfast sandwich or something. So it's got eggs, avocado, tomatoes. It looks really good. I'm excited about that actually. <laughs> it's gonna be so good. But what's really great, we already know, is the coffee. Yeah, I got the pumpkin spice classic. Um, and Megan, what'd you get? I got the butter queer. Butter queer. Is what I know? It was caramel and something. Oh. I can't remember what's in it. Well, it looks really good. Yeah. I'll have to try it. But yeah, we're gonna dive in and uh, we'll let you know how it goes. Oh. All right guys, so we're on our way to go get some iconic downtown Woodstock shots. Um, this town is adorable. It's freaking awesome. Look at this house. Looks like the house from Stranger Things. Percy! Doesn't it, Mac? Looks like the house from Stranger Things. Yeah, it does. It's like so scary, kind of. We'll show you what it look like, looks like along the way and uh, we'll show you where we get the photos. So we're at the Ardmore. So this is a cute little bed and breakfast. It's right outside of the downtown area, but still like downtown. Yes, uh, yeah, I mean, it just took us like two minutes to walk right here, so. But if you want like the picturesque, like fall movie photo, yes. this is the spot. It's perfect. All it of these so arms, leaves, yeah. the mums, the way they have it set up. It's perfect. It's absolutely beautiful. So yeah. picturesque. I love sure. it. Oh yeah. my gosh. We're <laughs> so going to get some pictures. We're going to get here. some pictures and we'll show you what we get. Fly, would I keep a 
So we've made it over here to this side of the neighborhood in Woodstock and it is so beautiful. These homes, they have pumpkins lining the fences and it is just the cutest little spot. So of course we're taking way too many photos, <laughs> but it's Bro, so gorgeous. Crazy. <laughs> like it is just such a pretty spot. We've got lucky. The, the leaves are looking absolutely perfect. Yes, truly. And so these houses are so cute. They're like just, from the early 1800s. Yeah, so we're just trying to get some really nice shots here um, and take in all of the cute fall decor. So we'll keep you posted. Alright, so we're at this little crooked fence post area. I don't even know what this is called. Do you? No idea but it's really, really cool. Yeah, <laughs> the white pumpkin fence. It's uh, an iconic spot that you'll see on Instagram a lot for the fall because it's so, so cool. So we're gonna get a few photos here and then we're gonna keep exploring, but yeah, I just wanted to show you guys what we're up got to. Got the tripod set up and we're ready to go. We'll show you what we get. So we've been walking around downtown Woodstock. Highly recommend. It is so stinking cute. It's beautiful here. It's so gorgeous. Of course, we knew it was going to be. We went into Woodstock Scoops and got us some, some ice creams. Ice cream. What one did I get again there? You got the maple creamy, which is what they're known for. Yeah, I haven't tried it yet. It's melting, so I gotta go for I it. I know the name of yours. Mmm. <laughs> so good. You gotta try it. It's so sweet. Mm. Oh my lord. Yeah, That's no wonder so they're known good. for it. It's really, really good. I love the maple sprinkles she put on top. Yeah, so it's maple creamy with maple sprinkles on top. Mine's a seasonal. I don't remember exactly what it's called, but it's like caramel apple something. Um, but it is so good. It's actually pretty, been pretty warm today, so mm -hmm. we're actually gonna walk towards the Woodstock Inn, which is super famous. We're gonna head that way while we eat our ice creams, and um, yeah, we'll show you what we get into. All right, so we're walking through the park in Woodstock, still heading towards the inn. They're having like a little festival today. It's super cute. I don't it's know what's really going on. It's really cute. But... I have no idea what's going on, but I love it, and I just cannot get over these trees. <laughs> Look at that over there. You see those trees over there? I know, it's so beautiful. There's the bridge. Oh my God, there's the bridge. Do you want to go over there first? <laughs> sure we can. Okay. We're going to get to the bridge first. <laughs> He's like a freaking squirrel. He's like... <laughs> I know, I'm tripping. I can't even keep up. I'm like running all over the place with no plan. Just crazy That's right now. That's not the way to do it, guys. Yeah. Okay? <laughs> not the way. We had a plan. We... He's not following it. We honestly had intentions to going up to Stowe, but um, honestly, there's just been so much that we've enjoyed here that yes. we're just gonna end up staying here all day and a little bit in the morning, so. But yeah, we're gonna get a photo here in front of this covered bridge. Yay, here we go. So we stopped by the famous Woodstock Inn and guys, it did not disappoint. It is so beautiful. We just got a photo here. I'll throw it in here. 
But yeah, it's a really cool spot. The way that the sun is coming through right now makes it look so, so beautiful. And everything is so symmetrical about like how they set up the landscaping and everything in the front. So it's like yeah, so picturesque. It's done very perfect. Yeah, very, um, very which beautiful. It's really cool. I saw that the Rockefellers, I believe, had some influence on this hotel. Uh -oh. So big name yeah. for wow. a pretty cool spot. So, uh, but yeah, I think we're gonna walk around downtown a little <laughs> bit more. We'll show you what we get into. So we're not going to Sleepy Hollow tonight. We're gonna go in the morning. Yes, which it's, was the uh, original plan actually. Yeah, it was the original so. plan. So uh, we just, it's getting so busy and we're getting hungry, so we wanna get some food. <laughs> yeah, before the sun sets and everything, just yeah. taking downtown some more. Yeah, I know, we got caught up here today and just taking so many photos and taking it all in. Mm -hmm. It's just so beautiful and so cute. Well, there are so many places to take photos and just walking around is so nice so like you want to actually get the most of it and enjoy it and not like rush through so. yeah for sure so yeah we're gonna find some food and uh we'll show you what we get into and what it's all about yeah so we made it back from dinner made it back i'm already in my comfy clothes <laughs> so we went to this place called dr coburn's mm -hmm. tonic yeah. In downtown Woodstock. I'm sorry we didn't vlog any of the food. We didn't get any video. They were having, they were a little backed up in the kitchen because it was so busy. So we yeah. were just, you know, trying to get stuff done. It was very hectic. And as we've learned being here, um, this time of year, as the fall colors change, it gets crazy busy. Especially for these like local small businesses, I think they feel kind of like bombarded yeah. a little bit it well seems, so. most of the places close around five or six o'clock mm -hmm. uh when it sunsets and none of Not the, restaurants, the restaurants but uh most of the restaurants close around eight o'clock so pretty early nights honestly especially compared to back home yeah absolutely um, but we've noticed it's a uh, outside of these peak times it's probably a slow town it mm -hmm. you know everyone's pretty chill everyone's super nice and laid back everyone was so nice yeah every local that we've talked to like especially the locals that live in the homes that are like the iconic spots to get photos of they've all like come out and chatted with us and have been so nice and tell us like recommendations and like are just so yeah. kind this honestly might be one of the nicest states that we've ever been to yes like every single person that we've met truly just in the past couple of days everyone has been all the like locals. over the top nice like crazy nice just asking us questions about ourselves mm -hmm. and uh just being so sweet and having so many nice things to say yes it's been really cool yeah that's so, always such a breath of fresh air so yeah. we love when we come to a place like this and feel like super welcome for sure so tomorrow uh we're gonna get up early we are. We're getting up early tomorrow. <laughs> and we are going to Sleepy Hollow Farm to get the iconic photo uh, that everyone gets and that you can see when you search this place. Yes. It's a so excited to see this Iconic spot. fall photo spot. So we're going to go there and get a picture to probably a hundred. Um, <laughs> and then we're going to head to downtown and, you know, explore a little bit before we head out. Yeah. Um, also, you didn't tell them about what we got, which it's... A melting a little bit um here. we got a slice of pop it open pumpkin pie cheesecake looks mm. amazing the whipped cream is melting a little bit but it looks and smells so this so is good. from the restaurant we ate at last night we swung by there and got mm, we got a piece <laughs> and it was actually their last piece piece <laughs> last piece um, so we're gonna try it, and uh, do you want to do a first bite really quick? Heck yeah! Just let's let do everyone it. know how it is. Yeah. Did you say where it's from? Uh, public house. Public house. The place we ate at last night. Yes. Okay. Here we go. Is it good? Oh yum! That's so good. Yeah. You're gonna love this. I love the. Um, Oh, ma'am. That's so good. That's really good. All right, guys. Well, we'll see you in the morning. <laughs> see ya.
Good morning. Good morning. <laughs> so it's our last day in Vermont. Sad times. So sad. We do not want to leave this place. We've already seen so many beautiful trees and fall colors. It is super gorgeous this morning. Um, so we're actually at the famous Sleepy Hollow Farm. So we're gonna excited. get some photos and we're already pumped. You can kind of see the barn and everything in the background there. So we're gonna walk up the road, yeah. get some photos. It's uh, 9 a.m. so it's nice and overcast, which will be great for photos. The colors are already popping so much um, and there's not too big of a crowd. There's about 10 cars. Yeah. So that's not bad. That's what we see. So we'll, yeah. we haven't been up there yet, so it might be busier than we think. We'll show you guys what it looks like because this is definitely a must see. Absolutely. Guys, this is so crazy beautiful. Megan was right. She just said, I think these leaves are paid actors. <laughs> They're showing out for us. Right the now. way that they're just going <laughs> off right now, and like the leaves are just falling right on cue. It's craziness. It's just the most beautiful place. I can't get over it. It's gorgeous. It's so gorgeous. Yeah, I think we're going to get some shots down this little road right here because these trees are crazy beautiful. But yeah, highly recommend this spot. It is unreal. So Sleepy Hollow, gotta do it. Absolutely. It's so sick. It is incredible. We're back in downtown Woodstock. It's raining pretty good right now. Uh, there's some pretty big storms coming this way today, but we're gonna hop in downtown, uh, probably get some souvenirs, maybe a sweatshirt. We're gonna hop right in. Hop in. And then we're <laughs> gonna get maybe a magnet. We'll show you guys what we get. Uh, but we gotta find a magnet. We gotta find a magnet. <laughs> All right, we'll show you guys what we get. All right, so we want to show you guys what we got in downtown Woodstock. Yes, so I got this super cool sweatshirt. I don't remember what that store was called, unfortunately. It's the cutest store. Yeah, can't remember. The bag doesn't have a name on it. And I didn't get a receipt. Fail, but it is such a cute store. It's a like women's boutique. Um, and they had this super simple Vermont crew neck and we thought it was perfect. Yeah, it was awesome. I loved that. So got that. And then we went into the bookstore across the street and we got our pretty magnet. Yeah, I know. I think you can see it. It's so cute. It's such so a good cute. one. They even had the postcard version of this. So really good thing to get for yeah. trips. If you collect postcards or magnets, that's a goody one. Yeah, it's really cool. They have like a general store. They've got bookstores. They've got, you know, really cool boutiques, yeah. thrift stores, all these things down there that's awesome to check out. So Yes, definitely. Um, but yeah, I think we're gonna head to the Vermont sign and get a photo. Yep. And, and wrap it up. Wrap it up. <laughs> so sad. All right, we'll see you guys there. All right, so that wraps up our time in Woodstock, Vermont. <laughs> so sad, but it was such an incredible stop. Um, we're so glad that we got to enjoy Woodstock and we want to see more of Vermont. So we'll definitely be making a trip back. Yes, I know. We feel like two days wasn't long enough. We want to come back and do more. Yes, Woodstock is literally everything you hope it would be and more. It's your picturesque fall town and it lives up to the high. Yeah, for sure. everything you see online, it's true. And even better in person. Yes, so. we were so blown away all weekend. So. Yeah, it was um, so great. But yeah, we're on our way to New Hampshire. So uh, we're about to hit the road. Remember to like, subscribe, follow. Yes, please. Let us things. know what you thought of this video. Yep. And we'll see you in the next one. We'll see you in the next one. See you in New Hampshire. Bye guys. This is where